What's up, first of all, we're back with another one. All right, this is this is my little Windex or DTG, which is actually his initials of his real name, I believe, or so I've heard. Maybe that's a rumor. I don't know. This is a rapper that's been around for a while. He's also doing some really funny, like, Eminem spoof videos, uh, little short videos. But uh, he's a rapper that's been around for a while. I think he's super underrated and underappreciated. Uh, so I'm going to get into this and see what this Blame Game song is about. I expect there's a lot of bars, a lot of heavy, heavy bars. So we're probably going to catch them all, but we're going we're gonna to listen and see what this song's about without further ado. I like that beat, those bells. Yeah. Yo, I can list a hundred reasons why I just don't give a fuck, but I just don't give a fuck to. What's this world to come to? Don't nobody have a clue. Somebody needs to come through and hit a button to undo whatever the fuck we done to. Get ourselves in this position, got the system taking over. We're just victims of the sick and twisted game with the controller in the hands of some rich and heinous older white prick who's made his goal in life to infiltrate our only rights to simply take them over. I'm ready for war, who's ready to join me? They will never destroy me. They can't censor my voice. See, I'm unstoppable, I'm untamable. Fuck the he uh he definitely got an old school like Eminem flow vibe to him. That's one of the things I like about him because I mean, old school Eminem. He doesn't sound exactly like Eminem, but I see why people get confused thinking it's him. Uh, but Eminem doesn't rap like he used to. So if you want something that kind of fits that theme and vibe, this guy is probably the closest you're gonna get. And sure, the name Lil Windex throws a lot of people off. Yo, Lil Windex is a meme. This is this is him, DTG. Like, I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong, but that's that's how it feels to me. Let's go. Anatalia, whatever. All I'm saying is, uh, the only fake news we care about is WrestleMania. They hate on our opinions. Cause the only fake news we care about is WrestleMania. That's sick, though. As soon as I try mine, they remove it because it went against community guidelines. Guide the games, I don't want to play no more than fucking up my brain. The world's crashing down and really nothing is the same. Can't even go outside right now, the stuff is getting strange. All I'm saying is that the government's to blame. They put us all in cages and they feed us what they like. They pin us all against each other just to see us fight. The hands are in our pockets and we're not supposed to bite. Whoa. Motherfucker, I like I'm The government's to blame, he said. That, isn't that the truth? Let's go. No standing it. Can't even joke without an oversensitive folk mention their own sense to it. Like, oh, Bathy is so sexist and no prejudice. This whole image is not impressive. I'm so upset with it, but also so obsessed with it. No, I'm not. Why are you watching it? Why are you stalking my shit just to come fire off on it? Hoping that I acknowledge it. Bitch, you don't even follow. Get off of my dick and balls a bit. I am not gonna stop. So sit back if you have an issue and grab a tissue and pack it with you for the next time you come dancing into my world just to have a kick you directly in the ass. Jiu Jitsu. Please don't don't give a fuck about me, I don't have a fuck to give you. While we're here, fuck every Karen over Karen, always Aaron, voices blaring over Karen over Karen, 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 Karen over Karen. Yeah, F every Karen, 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 Karen. Uh, F you, Karen. Let's go. I don't have a fuck to give you While we're here, fuck every Karen over Karen Always there and voices blaring over Baron They should perish like the parents Shitty marriage, you be fair but you ain't scary You're just ugly Fuck your thoughts and your thought of me I will rob you for your money so don't be lame Nobody likes a person when they knows you and complain If you don't know a thing about me Don't speak on my name You shouldn't start a fire if you can't control the flames All I'm saying is you're the only one to blame If everybody focused on themselves we'll be fine And you can handle your shit and I can handle mine But the second you decide that's facts though. Everybody focus on the sales and we'll be fine. And you can handle your business and I can handle mine. Right? Come on, world. Sales and we be fine. And you can handle your shit and I can handle mine. But the second you decide you wanna step over the line. Whoa, a motherfucker is dying. I support local mills. He 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 does a lot of comedy stuff and uh you know the the shirts that's that's one of the ways he gets his he gets his bread to keep doing his thing. So go support him. Uh, it may not be everybody's taste, and that's fine. But uh, I'm just telling you, this dude is sick. Don't sleep on him. If you like hip hop, make sure you go leave Lil Windex, DTG, whatever you want to call him, some love. I'm Versifier. I'm your favorite reactor. I'm also your favorite rapper, unless he is. Who knows? But you can check out, find out by checking my original music up here as the outro goes. Deuces!